Coach said it. Um, this was kind of the kind of the the pre uh, the pre start to the, the postseason tonight. So first off, what was the biggest takeaway to get this uh, this dub tonight to kind of get that mojo going uh, for next week against Kelso? Definitely, def definitely on the defensive side. I think I think we picked it up strong. I think the offense made a, a few a couple big mistakes uh, in the first quarter, and I think uh, Jaden and Christ in the offense just did a great job uh, bouncing back and just. Just getting with it, and uh, we had a really great sequence right before the uh, end of the first half. And I think, you know, we scored twice in the last two minutes of the uh, the second quarter, and it just it translated well. We had a great halftime speech by our coaches. We we're just really hyped up. We got out here and and we just took care of business. Zero second half points. Really strong defensively. Our offense did a good job keeping the ball for a, a long amount of time, and I think that just really helped secure this win and move us into next week with a lot of a lot of a lot of motion. Looking forward to it. I agree with him. I feel like it was really just a team effort. Coming out of the locker room, we kept up the gas. I feel like that played a big part. And um, yeah, it was really first first half, it was defense. Second half, offense locked in. I love it. I love to see my team win. I love playing a part, you know. Uh, yeah, that's it. Obviously, yeah, you guys kept a prairie off the scoreboard with, with some zeros in that second half. Um, you know, Jaden doesn't throw a lot of interceptions. He doesn't have a lot of mistakes. All of a sudden, a couple pick sixes, and it's just like, whoa. How did this defense get locked in that second half to really set the tone for, for that offense? How, uh, our coaches, they, they keep up the energy. They got a positive mindset all the time. Coach Seagard loves him. He always, he always loves him. He always mad, too, but... Hey, get us up, we wake us up, keep us moving and going. So yeah, and, I say coaches. And I want to thank like our whole team. You know, Jay, you know, you throw two pick sixes back to back. That's really hard. And it, it's really hard. But I think our team and, and definitely uh, give props to Jaden and Chris because I mean, he just locked in. We were just telling him to take deep breaths, wash it, next drive, and and we really moved on. And and he he made some he made some big plays, riders, cats back here, and just. Yeah. It was really strong. I think defensively and offenses were defensive and defensively and offensively we were very balanced tonight in how we played and, and we just went out here, we competed. Prairie's a good team. I mean they beat Kelso who we play next week and they're for sure they're a good team. They're a good team. So yeah, so speaking of dogs on defense, let's talk about the fourth and eleven play. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that was that was a big one. That was that was very surreal for me and and it was something I wanted for a, a long time and I'm glad I got it my senior year, game before my last a guaranteed game I guess and it was, it was a big deal for me and my, my family was here and able to see that and that was it was really awesome so what did you see obviously you're you're obviously Prairie coming trying to to do a little disruption the, the final drive of the game but what did you see kind of flying up from the linebacker spot I mean I just I trust our coaches they they called a play that I I didn't see the the first time and they're like yo and I mean like, Logan we're calling this for a reason and I mean sure enough they were they were they were calling it for a reason and it worked out so I mean I just see him I see him kind of back there. I was like, all right, all I have to do is get past this guard, and which I was doing all night. And really, Pearson was the only one picking me up. And they were running that empty set, and Pearson wasn't there. And I was like, this, this is my opportunity. And it sure was. He didn't even move. It was like he saw a ghost. He just froze up and tried throwing it, throwing it, bounced off my helmet, and just eye hand coordination. You saw a lot of green turf in front of you. A lot of green turf in front of I was trying not to look behind me. I was gassed. I was my right elbow, my my whole upper arm is just was completely numb, and I was just gasping for air. And I was I was I'm not gonna lie, jogging. I had I had Fox behind me. He, yeah, I, had, I, had, I had six, seven, three hundred pounds keeping up with me. So I think I need to pick up the speed a little bit. Yeah. Speaking of opportunity, obviously uh, the three A G S H L unfortunately only gets two playoff berths. Mm -hmm. But you guys have now put yourselves in in cruise control as far yes. as setting your own destiny. So what do you guys got to do next week to lock that in? Yeah. So what has to happen for you guys to get that dub? So uh, you first, I can go first. So. Uh, win or lose, we'll probably be put in a three-way tie, but that happened last year, and we don't want to be in that situation. So we're not coming in with we're coming in with the same mentality as this. We have to win. We have to win. That's that's crucial for us to get a good seed in playoffs, and and we, we have to win. Win. That's got to be our word yeah. of the week. It's just win. win. I like that. Actually. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I feel like we just got to stay locked in as a team. Usually, we be distracted playing around in practice. We yeah. end up focusing, but I'm gonna just at, for my part, I'm gonna try to keep the team locked in. And, Help them focus up and practice so that we don't got to do stupid stuff, make stupid mistakes in the game. But energy, win, uh, and dedication, we don't really need motivation. We just need consistency. So, yeah, that's it.
Defensively, where would you rank as maybe the better performances that you guys have had all year? Is this is this one up there? Definitely yeah. this one. This is our best performance because you know we played the first three teams, and I mean, I mean, I'm not no no shade to them, but they weren't the best teams. This this was this was a good Prairie team. This was I mean, this is a team we lost to last year, and I think this was our best defensive performance. I mean, there was mistakes made, but this was definitely our best defensive performance all year, for sure.